Good morning. So we're back in the, the Saab 93 with the Z19DTH engine. Um, the other day I got a fault code come up, which was P0335, which is a crankshaft sensor. Uh, so hopefully, when I change this round, it's going to get rid of the the stuttering and the, the bad idle. I was actually um, driving it the other day and I came up to a speed bump. And when I slowed down the thing uh, kind of stalled, so that's quite a good uh, indication that the crankshaft sensor's knackered. So I get a new one for like 30 quid. So I'm going to fire that in just now, delete the fault code and then uh, see how that goes. So we'll go underneath the car and have a wee look. So here we are underneath the Batmobile. So we passed the oil filter and then there is the crank sensor. So let's figure out how to get this um, bad boy out. So that's the old part out, which I think the technical term was a bastard. So I'm going to put some oil around the new one and uh, see if I can get that in and see if it fixes the problem. So that's the, the new sensor then. Um, I'm about to take it a test drive, but before I do it, I'm going to um, do a wee scan and see if it's showing up any fault codes. I've got no warning lights, um, but we'll do a wee quick scan. So here's the results. So this is where we would have been getting the hesitation earlier on. I'm just coming off the throttle, gently feathering the throttle, and it's absolutely fine and dandy. Give it a bit of welly, and away we go. So she's up to temperature and she's idling um, quite contently. The test drive was absolutely fine. Um, all the codes have been cleared and the thing's running um, as sweet as a nut for now anyway. But I'm glad that um, that's uh, fixed that problem because it was starting to be a bit of a pain in my ass and I was actually looking at other other cars but again I would have just been chucking money into the unknown but at least with this thing I know it's all been done so with regard to the, the engine side of things recently this thing's had a couple of injectors MAF sensor replaced, thermostat replaced, MAP sensor replaced, EGR replaced, uh, throttle body cleaned so loads of stuff done to it the the vacuum lines but um it's okay now 